Hey y'all, it's your Nintendo Nerd Shredder here, and me, Inkling Girl. And today, we're going to be continuing more of Mario Kart 8 Deluxe's Booster Course Pass. Yep, the DLC. And I'm so glad I'm playable in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe. It's the only game I'm playable in. Yeah, we'll have to see if you'll come back for a future Mario Kart game, but... Anyways, um, remember, you're doing 200cc. Oh god, I, I don't play much 200cc at all when I play this, I play 150. Well, I guess... Um, good luck then! Okay, well I'm gonna try my best then! Will me! Alright, the Turnip Cup. Almost forgot to mention we're doing the Turnip Cup, but anyway, you all already know because it's in the title. Anyway, we're doing New York Minute! Will me! Okay, let's see how I do. Will me! You really like to say your catchphrase a lot, don't you? Yep. Will me! Okay. I get mad at Inkling Boy when he says Vimo. It really annoys me. Yeah. Well, <sighs> it's not like we're gonna get Octoling plushies anytime soon. Sine, what are you doing? What are you doing, Sine? What are you doing? Oh, you're doing well. Well, it's just 150 but faster, right? Not any extra things the CPU aren't harder, are they? No, they're still just hard. I still want expert CPU. I want expert CPU, but Nintendo still hasn't given us that. So, that's why I definitely want to do online for these Shiro the Gamer episodes. We'll still do, still do plush gaming for Mario Kart 8 Deluxe as well. That's not going to stop. We're going to continue doing more of that as well. But just so we have a main focus. Focusing on Mario Kart and some other games. It's good to focus on in Shiro the Gamer. Well, you're almost done. What? Already? Yep, <laughs> that's the track. Whoopee! Oh, you did it! Good job! Yes! Oh, Inkling Boy is actually racing as well, I didn't notice. Oh, and Funky. Adding some Funky to the roster. <laughs> I still remember when um, Funky Kong and Peachette and Pauline and um, Diddy got revealed on <laughs> with Pico Sparks' reaction. When they showed Diddy, he was like, Yeah! 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 And then when Funky showed up, he was like, BOO! BOO! And then when Poop Pauline showed up, he was like, YEAH! 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 And then when Peachette showed up, he was like, NO! BOO! 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 <laughs> that, was, that was so funny. I want to rewatch that again. It's also part of his quotes on, on his Discord server. I'm part of the PK Sparks Discord server, which is nice. So if you don't know who PK Sparks is, he's a uh, Nintendo YouTuber. Mainly does Mario content, but he also likes to do a lot of other Nintendo content as well. Um, I've known him for a very long time. I've known his channel since 2013. He's a pretty decent, um, big YouTuber. He's got a um, good amount of subscribers. I think it's like over 200,000 now, I think. Yeah, quite a lot. A lot more than us. <laughs> so... No, you're doing pretty well. Let me. So yeah, just check out PK Sparks' channel. You, you won't regret it. I, I really love his videos. Ow! So yeah, he's. I, I've just got back into watching him. Like, I think it was like late last year. Just um, on because he started uploading more frequently again. Because he just stopped uploading for a while, and then now he's back. So I was like. Oh yeah, it's finally a good time to get back into watching one of my good old favourite YouTubers. And you blocked it, good. Yeah, did it! Woo me! Woo me! Alright, that's good. So, is it true that you're in a relationship with Inkling Boy? Uh, yeah. Alright, I just wanted to make sure. And now, Calamari does it. To be honest, I'm not really a fan of this version. Like, I know it's cool to race on the train track, but 
I kind of like Mario Kart 7's version a bit more. But, yeah, th this is good in its own way. I just wish if there was a way to actually race normally on this track and not go onto the train track. But, anyway, I shouldn't complain. Because it's still, still, this is still pretty good. No one's complaining. I'm not complaining. I just, I just prefer the Mario Kart 7 version. And even even the original um, Nintendo 64 version as well, in a way. What are you doing? You're off the track. Oh, whoops! I just blinked for a second and... Whoa! Oh, you're still doing well. Oh, get ready to go on the train tracks. Here comes Thomas! It's Thomas and friends like you've never seen him before. In an all-new 2D animated look. Oh crap, that sucked. Okay, is any uh, anyone watching actually ended up watching All Engines Go? Because that that was that was disgusting. I almost threw up when I saw that for the first time. All engines die. That's what I show. That's what I call it. Thomas and friends. All engines die. Because I, they actually got rid of a lot of the original characters too from that, <laughs> Thomas. I think they got rid of like Edward and a few others. So, that's sad. That's sad. Anyway, that was Calamari Desert. So. Oh, poor Funky, he's in 11th. <laughs> Larry, 12th. Oh, Inkling Boy's in top 3, not bad. Okay, and Peach at 6th. Okay. Wimmy! You're gonna continue saying Wimmy throughout the whole video? Okay, fine, I'll say, I'll say Inkling Boy's phrase. Need Jess! Need Jess! Need Jess! Bemo! I thought you don't like it when he says Bemo. Well, I don't like it when he says Wimmy either. Okay. Why don't you like it when, uh, when he says it? I don't know, because I think he's making fun of me or something. I think he's just having some fun. Just maybe cut him some slack. He's normally pretty chilled. And I think I think he'll get to join for... I was thinking of Inkling Boy joining for battle mode when we do battle mode. So I think that would make sense because if he joins for battle mode, um, you'll get to do the, um, the battle mode tracks. Which one of them is Urchin Underpass. So that would make sense. So... I chose you to do racing, and Inkling Boy can do battle mode. Yeah, I don't really like battle mode in this game anyway, so I'm, I'm glad you picked me for racing. Yeah, that's what I thought. So Inkling Boy might have to suffer with battle mode, even if he doesn't like battle mode, but we'll just have to see what he thinks when he plays it. And the battle mode episodes will be a bit longer than these, because... Eight battle mode tracks and throughout different modes, and of course it depend on how long the mode is as well. Uh oh. Oh, you did the skill. Good job. Uh oh. Ow! Maybe I should have defended. Well, you still pulled off the blue shell invincibility frames trick, so I guess you did fine. Anyway, I, I think probably with Waluigi Pinball, this is, I'd say this is my favorite version of Waluigi Pinball. They did, they did a pretty good job with this, this version. Not too much changes, just more graphic changes. Just, it looks more like Mario Kart 2's version. They pretty much used Mario Kart 2's version for this. Um, but they didn't really do any major changes. So, I, I like how they they did this track. Except the only one complaint is that they didn't make a new remix from this track. They just used the um, Wario Stadium one, which... It's, it's still the same song, and it's not really something to complain about, but it's a shame that this is the only track that didn't get a, a, a new remix for. It just shares the same as Wario Stadium. Which doesn't really, in a way, it doesn't actually fit entirely because they made the song with Wario Stadium mind and not Waluigi Pinball. So if they did it, if they made that song with Waluigi Pinball in mind, I 
think they would have made it sound a bit more electronic. Like a bit more arcadey, like the original. So that's why it kind of sounds out of place. It kind of sounds more like thinking of in the stadium. But anyway, it's it, it's still okay. It's still the Waluigi pinball theme. Anyway, you aced the turnip cup. Congrats. And I like how you picked your Splatoon on combination there. Yep, woo me! You get past there. Oh, Inkling, oh, Inkling Boy was the one that fired the red shell. Oh, naughty boy. <laughs> oh, naughty boy. Oh, well, well, you did it. I didn't think you would actually manage to pull this off without any problems. 200cc, three stars. Nice. Yep. Well, I I think it was just I was just thinking of playing 150 but faster, and I managed to pull it off. Well, you did a good job. Congrats. Thank you. Will me. Well, guys, I guess that's it for today's episode of Shiro the Gamer on Mario Kart 8 Deluxe 200 CC Booster Course Pass. Oh God, now I'm doing the mouthful thing again. The mouthful, mouthful. Oh God. You okay? Yeah, it's just sometimes I get my tongue twisted. I think you could have noticed there. It's just uh, like sometimes don't like you sometimes have a problem with stumbling. Like sometimes I stumble, so that's why sometimes you might see on the videos that we do have to do cuts, and that's because like either I stumble or one of the characters stumbles. So that's why we sometimes have to do cuts because we don't want to show an embarrassing stumble on video, do we? No, we don't. Yeah, so. Hopefully there's no stumbling for the rest of this video. Yeah. Anyway guys, so I um, hope you enjoyed today's episode of Share the Gamer on... I'm not saying all that again, but Mario Kart 8 Deluxe, 200 seasons... Oh no, I'm saying it again. Oh well. Well, um, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. So, if you enjoyed it, hit that like button, share to your friends, and subscribe to the channel if you're new. And I guess we'll see you next time for some more gaming. Bye guys! Will me! See y'all!